Hey guys, it's Jen and tonight I'm going to be going on a romantic dinner date and I'm going to be wearing this shoe from Nine West. As you can see, it's very classic and just has a very glamorous feel. So I was inspired by it to do an old Hollywood glamour makeup tutorial. So I'm going to start off using an eyeshadow primer. This is just going to help your eyeshadow to last all night. So I'm just applying this all over both of my eyelids. And now I'm going to take my eyeshadow palette. I'm going to go in with this shade right here, which is a light frosty champagne color. You're going to pat this on the middle of the lids and blend it out to either side. Next I'm taking this medium brown color. It's a matte eyeshadow, so it's going to just be a really classic look. And I'm going to apply this to the outer corners of my eye. We're going to blend the shade into the hollows of your eyes right here. So if you take your brush and push into the eye socket, where it goes in is where you're going to be shading. Now I'm taking this blending brush and I'm just going to smooth out all of the edges. Now taking this deep cocoa brown, I'm going to darken the outer corners even further. This is just going to go right in the outer corners and blend upward. Next I'm going to take this light eyeshadow color and I'm going to apply that right beneath my brows on both sides just really lightly and that's going to bring light into your eyes and really open them up. I'm going to go in with my liquid eyeliner pen and I'm going to draw a very thick line on my upper lash line that wings out at the outer corners. So the bottom line is going to go up from my lower lash line up toward my eyebrow and we're going to have the line meet where I drew the top line. You can also use that eyeliner to blend really lightly to emphasize the lower lash line. Now I'm going to go back in with my dark eyeshadow and I'm going to smoke out the lower lash line. Now I'm going to curl my eyelashes, so just tilt your head back, try to get in as close as you can to the lash line. You're going to squeeze them at the base, move a little bit further up, squeeze them in the middle, and then go at the very tips and curl them again. This way they'll get more of a lift and more of a natural curl than just curling them once. Next I'm going to apply my mascara. So just starting at the base of my lashes, I'm just wiggling it so that the mascara can cover my lashes from root to tip. To give my eyes that really bright and awake look, I'm going to take a beige eyeliner and line my waterline. I'm also going to apply this on the inner corners of my eyes and just blend that out really gently with my finger. To give a bit of extra drama, I'm going to apply some false eyelashes. I like the ones that flare out at the ends a little bit more because they just look a lot more vintage -y and glamorous. Next, I'm going to take a red lip liner and starting at the cupid's bow, I'm going to outline my lips. Once you're done creating a really precise outline, you're actually going to fill in the entire lip. Doing this versus just outlining it is going to help your lipstick to last a lot longer and have the color stay a lot truer. Next, we're going to fill in our lips with lipstick and again, we're going to start at the center of the lips and work our way out. 
We're not done quite yet. Take a piece of tissue and blot your lips. And then apply the lipstick one more time. And that is going to help your lipstick last all night, no matter if you eat or talk or whatever happens. This red lipstick is going to stay put. So this is the final look and I'm so excited to see my date tonight. It's time to go and get dressed. So this is my final look and I'm so excited about it because I feel like the whole look just really comes together in that old Hollywood glam style that I was going for. So I'm just wearing this little black dress. I love it because it has some sparkly texture to it. And then I have a nice statement necklace that gives a little bit more sparkle to the look. I have these clover shaped earrings which I think just bring out my features and they have such a classic shape. Of course, the makeup pulls it all together and matches so well with my sparkly bow shoes, which I absolutely love. And I just think the whole look comes together from head to heel. Well, I don't want to be late for my date, so I have to get going, but I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and if you did, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to Channel 9. This is Jen, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.